Okay, so this is my house in Minecraft. Uh, this is going to be my first of many gaming commentary videos. Um, so, yeah, here it is. I went with a retro modern look. Um, added a little street lamp and a fake address right there. I thought that was a nice little touch. Um, wow, these, these cows really pissing me off. Um, so, to enter my house, it requires a key or a, uh, redstone torch. And, uh, you walk in, and you first you notice the, um, unique flooring. Um, I kind of copied it off this dude from YouTube. I would give him credit if I remembered his name, but it was such a long time ago. But, it's called Feng Shui Flooring. Um... I mean, I know that he didn't make it up. It's some Asian thing, but it's supposed to, like, have the flow of chi in your house or something. I don't know. Well, and, uh, so here's the kitchen. I, um, uh, got a refrigerator. That's really that all that matters. <laughs> Fridge and microwave, man. It's all that you need to live. But... To just take up space, I added a counter and a stove. And uh, I store stuff in the counters. Actually, that's the only one that I have stuff in at the moment. But I normally have more stuff. And uh, to like make ice or frozen stuff, I put uh, diamond blocks. And uh, so you walk into the foyer now. And you got a burning skull right there. <laughs> but, um, we also, you got a chair and a couch. And my lava fall to replace the, um, to replace a, uh, fireplace. Yeah, sorry. Forgot the word right there for a second. Yeah, to replace my fireplace. Because I'm just sick and tired of putting fireplaces in houses. And, um, yeah, so thought that was a nice little addition and uh... an empty room Ooh, cool. empty room I don't know what to do with it if you have a recommendation put a comment below um... and also does this Pete, this window remind me of that annoying piece in Tetris that you can never seem to fit wow y you know what you can insert that's what she said joke right there <laughs> and uh... so we're walking up the stairs and right here you got a uh... work counter area right there you got supplies and crafting square and then just some filler to make it look like a counter and porch it's a great view if I didn't have to fog the entire world to get all this crap to load. And uh, then you got a disco dance dance thingy. And uh, yeah, I'm not 50 years old, so I don't know what a disco dance floor would look like, but I'm assuming that's what it would look like if, you know, I ever been to one. And so I got a disco ball and, you know, the whole, like, whitey up floor thingy. And some records. And, uh, then I got my greenhouse. Gonna put some cocaine plants and roses. And that's enough of that in music right there. I don't even know if you can hear that, but it's pissing me off because I have my speakers up really loud. And, um... See, I think that's it for my house. I have another project going on, but you can't really see it because of all the fog. Let's see if I can turn the fog off without my computer being a bitch. Okay, there we go. That's a work in progress. I am currently working on making my own city of rapture. It's more of a of evolution of the concept rather than an exact replica but um yeah and that's 
um, if you've ever played Bioshock 1, you'll probably remember the tower that you, um, when your plane crashes, you have to go into, and then Andrew Ryan gives a whole speech, or a recording of a speech, whatever, and, um, yeah, too bad that Bioshock Infinite is going to be in Rapture, because that would be really nice. I don't know, I have mixed feelings about that game. I, uh, I mean, I want to like it because it's Bioshock, but it would just all in all looks kind of sucky so uh, but if you have any opinions leave a comment below I'll be sure to read through them and maybe you know say something about it in a video to come cause I will be making a lot more commentary videos of mostly first person shooters and um so just keep a watch out for those if you like this one and uh you know if you really liked it you can subscribe I don't want to be like one of those people that are subscription whores but uh if I have to be I guess I will so subscribe now yeah that was that was me being a subscription whore like uh you know Smosh and all them but I guess they get paid so it's okay well, uh, that's my house. Thank you for watching.